now i can see so good evening friends good evening sir at the onset let me thank dr ajay and his whole team for giving us a, such a beautiful novel idea as i said i have been practicing in sexual medicine for 40 years but i think this is one of the most unique and i would ask all of you to give a round of applause to dr ajay and his team right so i have been given a topic of pre and post era of pd5 inhibitors in sexual medicine practice if you ask me really i would like to sing a song from mera naam joker ke jaane kahan gaye wo din ke without viagra karte the hum treat to be honest with you it gave me such a beautiful thought for last couple of days when i was preparing the slides i would like to take you in a time machine from 1970 to 2022 february like a kaleidoscope when you go on changing kaleidoscope you see different pattern every time and this is what exactly i have been seeing as far as the sexual medicine is concerned you may find it is my story no it is just a documentation of what i have gone through so i am taking you in a time machine to 1970 and what is sex tonic these were the drugs or some organ from the family uh, the animal body or they were something like a fruits or natural substances like root or other things which resembled male organ or a female organ and i let me tell you more than us the lay people used to know much more about it so as a medical student when i started my practice in 1970 as a family practitioner i had practically no knowledge interestingly this penis fly i would ask all of you to see a movie if you can get it it's a hilarious movie cantharidin is the substance which causes the urogenital tract you know it causes a irritation and person may get an erection but the between therapeutic dose and the lethal dose there is a very small little window and that's why that came went away then what are the things we had used alcohol cocaine marijuana spanish fly lizard oil horns of animal it looks like a male and many rhinos were killed ginseng shilajit amphetamine lsd hormones testosterone muesli pak oyster and pan which is this pan not an ordinary which you take you know from your pan wala this was available at chopati it is known as a palang tod pan palang means it's a bed which can be broken once you start having a sex and that much stamina you will get it it will have a power stamina and vitality these were the days now again right from my childhood i was born in 1946 so i think around 1950 onwards i have been seeing there were a lot of home remedies traditionally they were coming from one generation to another so honestly let me say that you know i went into a nostalgia i was trying to understand from childhood the methi laddu all our ancestors they used to have a during winter season methi laddu and i will say that what is the important today mostly we were saying in a bombay near the central bombay you know over there and lot of women during just before the winter in the december they will go to masjid bandar which is a main hub of all the dry fruits from there they will get a musli make a white powder put it into glass of milk and give it to it. and i have taken lot of musli powders in the morning <laughs> and aradia aradia is nothing but a black gram you know ad 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 ka dal jo urad ka dal hum log kehte tadka deke so adat pak and winter they used to have a special and they were available at sweets wala this is only available in winter it used to have all sorts of dry fruits as i said vasana and other things and lastly spark swami prakashanand ayurved research center swami prakashanand ayurved research center this is a bhavan's group of people you know we were there and i was there as a honorary fellow for the research and i could found out that ashwagandha and kaucha park they have got a sub sort of a substance and now you will see lot of medicine coming out and last but not least is chavan pras 
This is Rasayana, which can be taken for a very, very long period. Now, these are the two words I want to see. On the right side is Rasayan Vati. Thakan Mitaya, Stamina Badai. And the other side is a Vaji Karan. If you go to Shushruta and Charak, Ayurveda, there are eight stamp or what you call a pillar of Ayurveda. And out of them, two pillars were given, one to Vajikaran and one to Rasayan. Rasayan is like any other day-to-day -day tonic, what we take vitamins and other things. One can take it right from the young days to the old age. But Vajikaran, only after puberty, what was happening? Ghode jaisi apar yon shakti ke liye. Vaji means horse and Karan means the way in which acts. This is how the thing was there, Vajikaran and Rasayan. And let me tell you, during our olden days, king had many harem, you know, they have wives or queens. And at the, in the harem, you know, a lot of queens were there. And that time, there was a special interest and special things were there that they wanted a good amount of sex tonic. And that is how it developed right from the ancient time. This Vajikaran and Rasayan has been going on. Now, then came, during when I started practicing Ayurveda, there's a great myth, and it was right at that time, that allopathy has no medicine. Only Ayurveda, Yunani, those Hakim, and other people, they have got some medication with their help. And during those days, what was doing? Himalaya. The Tentex Forte, silver color peel, and Himpolin was an ointment. This was sold abroad like, a, you know, Arab countries in millions. And they have made a lot of money. And after that, now we find more and more people. Dabar has come out. Then, you know, you see Jandu has come out. Charak has come out. Baba Ramdev has come out. They are all doing. And let me tell you very honestly, Ayurveda is our heritage. And that is, there was a pure science. What we need to do is understand research and oh, document, and which has started right now in some of the part of India. Other thing about Ayurveda, there were three types of Vajikara. One was, which was from a plant origin. Second one, which was the pranic origin from the animal. And last is khanij, that is mineral, like shilajit and other things. So these three types of things were there as far as the vajikaran. And I had presented paper more than 30 years back in an alternative medicine. It was at Jaslok Hospital. All world's conference was there and I was over there to present that. Now we see erect text. It has got right side. What you see is a methi. Friend of green. Nano Leo, this is Goksharu. So now more and more supplements are coming up. Today, they are being marketed. Our market is flooded with it. They say, why not to have, apart from the alternative citrate and other drugs, we should have this also as a supplement, nitrocyticals and other things. The only drug which we had in allopathy at that time was testosterone. Thinking that it has to do something with the male hormone. So if somebody has given, Dr. Thareja has given 100 milligram, I will say, oh, I'll give you a stronger one, 250 milligram. Let me tell you, friends, it has no role as far as the sexual dysfunction, except it increases the libido. Some role in hypogonadism as far as the erection is concerned, but that is not. Two things you must remember. Unless, unless, unless there is a biochemical evidence, do not give testosterone. Particularly to the young people, it will affect the spermatogenesis. And elderly people, all of you know, as far as the prostate and other cancers are concerned, it is contraindicated. It's a beautiful drug. I'm not saying that it is not a good drug, but it has to be used judiciously. And from a good laboratory, after having a good morning test, then, then you use it. Now the oral testosterone is available. And that is the time myself, Dr. Uh, Narayan Reddy and Dr. Brugesh Vaishnav, we were there at Kuala Lumpur. And that is the time, you know, aging male, they came out with 40 milligram of testosterone on deconate. I have used it. It's a good drug. You have a control over it. While if you give a sustain on 250 milligram, you do not have a control over the drug and how it is going to work it, you know. Yohimbin, Dr. Tareja has rightly said, this was a drug, what happened that this is a tree which you say, that tree's bark, that was being powdered. And what they found in USA is that the black population, they were more stronger than the white population as far as the sex is concerned. So then they started research and came out as a yohimbin hydrochloride. Ideal dose is 5.4 milligram three times a day. And if you see all other, they just put one or two milligram, which is no use. And it is available, marketed by two milligram. 
so you can slowly build up the dose the only advantage i find that with that the penis which was placid it remains little turgid so the people who are very much worried that mera penis chota ho gaya indriya choti ho gayi hai this is a good drug which can use it but now we have got and yohimex it has a not only yohimbin hydrochloride strychnine and testosterone three were available and these are available you know on market presidon as he very rightly say that this is an antidepressant interestingly it was found out by an indian scientist the mechanism of action is not fully understood not fda approved for the erectile dysfunction and it can cause a priapism but i have seen this one and the next drug which are being used by my psychiatric friend in a very big way this is one thing is does not have a sexual side effect so whenever they want to treat antidepressant you know as a medication so this and the second is the bupropion hydrochloride or valberti interestingly on the right side which you see is a phil donahu before ofra this was a person who started uh, really speaking the talk shows and let me share with you 1986 or 87 i remember in the new york i was attending the world conference sex is a power and there we were called and we were taken two shows live shows were done and that time none another but helen kaplan she was present there and she said well bertin is the really the first sensible sexual stimulant but anyway people they use it because it does not have a sexual side effect it can be a weak anti depression but they use it as a adjuvant and couple of people they come and feel because there's a feeling of well being they say bahut acha laga so that is what the bupropion hydrochloride story now let me tell you four drugs which has changed the life of a mankind first one was a penicillin second was insulin third was oral contraceptive pills and last but not least is the blue magic pill viagra or sildenafil citrate these are the four drugs if i have to put the drug of the centuries these are the drugs which has created the world now this was accidentally discovered they were trying to find the drug for the vasodilator for coronary vasodilator and interesting the patients they were not ready to part with it it didn't work as a coronary vasodilator but it was giving them a good erection and somebody brilliant person thought that why it cannot be used in the treatment of erectile dysfunction again let me say three times it does not increase sexual desire it does not increase sexual desire and it does not increase and what we need to do along with that that you person needs to stimulate many people they take it and they wait and they say kuch bhi nahi kaam kiya and they are carrying mis misconception for ages so maybe eight times different different times trial you should do it you know and this is one of the wonderful drug i have used it in plenty i was one of the chief investigator of the sildenafil citrate it was a multi centric trial two psychiatrists two urologists and myself two were from ahmedabad one from mandya one from bangalore and i from bombay it was a randomized study you know it was a placebo control and at the same time double blind studies which we had done it and i tell you it gave a beautiful results and now all of you have used it and you know that this is a very very good drug in the armamentarium of and it has changed the whole life so the way in which i have been given a topic that pre and post era i think it has made our life much easier and all of you who are practicing today are very very lucky because our time there was nothing available as i said some hormones yohimbin at the same time some of the sex education which we were also ignorant and later on came up you know sexual response cycle and other things you know and sexual behavior so this is how we used to treat those people during those days in 1998 dr robert louis and fred murad they were three different part of the usa and they were given a nobel prize for their nitric oxide which is a signaling molecule if you see that the the diameter of the artery because there's a endothelial inside and nitric oxide liberated which causes a vasodilatation and for that we are thankful that it's a beautiful drug now first time 1998 in march it came out it's a first oral safe convenient 
broad spectrum. It can take care of the psychogenic, it can take care of the vasculogenic, neurogenic, hormonal problems. So it's, it's, it's a, under one umbrella, you can put everything. Very, very effective. And the most important is FDA approved. This is a beautiful drug. And I tell you, as they were saying that during the first time, there was a fear that 130 deaths were reported. And then Pfizer went into a study and they found that those were not more than if those people, normal population who would have taken, it is same amount of the death would have occurred. So what initially fear was there. And I remember one of our sexologists from Bangalore, who was from Guntur area, Dr. Shekhar Dodamani, he took first time Viagra and he came, you know, his old picture came and it came on India today. And he said, after taking what happened and he described and how the thing, you know, it was a very fascinating, like a magic drug, what he was shown that it's a surprising thing. How does it act? A sexual stimulation and the physical stimulation is required. Without physical stimulation, nothing will happen. And then the nitric oxide liberated, which convert cyclic GM, converted into cyclic GMP. Now this causes the blood vessels to dilate. And depending upon dilatation, the erection occurs. But the PD-5 enzyme converts cyclic GMP into GMP. So the drug which can stop the work, the inhibits PD-5. And that is how our most beautiful drug, Viagra, has come up. And how the name Viagra came? There are different theories. One say that it was the Niagara and Vitality. So Vitality and Niagara, that combined and made Viagra. And others said that strongest animal is Vaga, means tiger, Vyagra in Sanskrit. And that's how the word has come. Anyway, we are thankful to it. Now, this is another thing. Okay, how the nitric oxide is produced. In an endothelial cell, if you see one side is L-arginine and L-citrulline. Now, these are the precursors. They are required to produce a nitric oxide. And today, all of you are aware that so many new PD-5 inhibitor has come up. Sildenafil citrate, Vodanafil, Tadanafil, Udenafil, Microdenafil, Dodenafil, Avanafil, which is re recently available, SLX2101. And last, can I tell you a secret? I'm not surprised. Tomorrow or next year, if we get Ajayanafil from Kerala, I think that is also possible. So these are the PD5 inhibitor. L-arginine, lot of products are available in the market. It's a good thing. You can use it. As I said, there is a scientific reason to use it. It gives the people if that feeling that they are doing something. And I would put it as an adjuvant along with the sildenafil citrate of the choice. Sildenafil available 25, 50, and 100 milligram. I won't be saying more about it. Only thing is it has an abnormal reason. So before you take and give it to somebody, you must find it out that he has a retinal uh, uh, pigmentosa or at the same time, they have some sickle cell anemia or you examine those patients and are there any anatomical defect or angulation or other thing, those are the things we should keep it. People feel that by taking 50 to 100 or 100 to 200, it is not going to make any change as far as the drug is concerned. Only thing side effects will be much more. And the next is Tadalafil. If I say Saldanafil is a Sachin Tendulkar, Tadalafil is our uh, wall that is Dravid. And both of drugs are so wonderful. They are so complementary to each other. And I have been using them in a combination in a different way and different time. 2.5 milligram is available to the 20 milligram. The effect lasts for 36 hours, you know. Only thing you must keep the safety concern is it inhibitors of PDE5, PDE11, an enzyme in the testes which may affect the spermatogenesis. So that you should do it. The most beautiful part is it's a spontaneous and natural erection. But the erection which I have found the strongest is if suits the sildenafil citrate is the best one. Now, what are the side effects? I will not be going in the detail. But if you see abnormal reason I have said or a blue reason in only 5% of cases of sildenafil, apart from headache, dyspepsia, dyspepsia and backache, tadalafil, before you give, tell them that you will have a some of them may have a backache, rhinitis, and myalgia, flu-like symptom. And tell them if you get that, take a hot water bath, take a paracetamol of your choice. And then initially it takes, but then later on. But those people who have got a backache and other things, do not give them because it creates a serious problem. They come out, you know, very tired and, you know, with a lot of pain. 
Now, important safety consideration, recent myocardial infarction, stroke, life-threatening arrhythmias, or unstable angina, or severe hypertension and severe hypertension, you should not use it. Because this, as I'll tell you, that it creates a problem with organic nitride. So I remember Dr. Mukul Choksi from Surat, whenever he writes the prescription of sildenafil citrate, he puts the same. Along with this, no nitrates in any form should be taken. I think it's a very good idea. Tomorrow, nobody can chew because already you've written, you don't know. And there are different names of things that are available. Not only short-acting, long-acting, but at the same time, poppers, which are, you know, if you see that some of the people, you know, drug, is, uh, drug addicts, they try to take it, you know, to get more orgasm and other things. A period of 24 hours for short-acting PD-5, that is sildenafil or vodanafil if somebody has taken. And so many times it's available uh, from the chemist or some friends suggest, and they've taken and they got a chest pain. So you must always ask somebody comes that, have you taken some medication of sex? And if it is a sildenafil for 24 hours, you should not give anything. And if it is tadalafil, 48 hours. And as far as the vodanafil is concerned, Go into the detail, you know, their cardiac history and find it out what drugs they are using. And there are many drugs which increases the QT interval. So, vodanafil should not be given at that time. Now, the base one of the side effect or the effect of the Viagra, not side effect, the effect has come out. That for the first time, we were using for stop and start technique or squeeze technique for uh, premature ejaculation. We were also using tricyclic antidepressant or SSRI, which were not FD approved. First time the tapoxetin came out and it was FD approved. Yes, it has a no drug interaction, no SSRI withdrawal symptoms, no sexual side effect and loss of libido and ED is not there. I have used this along with any PDF if I of my choice and that has given a beautiful result as far as the premature ejaculation is concerned. People are confused. And they may not give a proper history that it was an erectile dysfunction or a premature ejaculation which caused a flaccid penis. Now, injectable, my friend Dr. Uh, Thareja has said, I was rather first to start uh, injectables. And I went to London from Dr. Solomon. I learned that. And when I came back, so I saw that it's a most wonderful drug. And I presented a paper in the fifth ISA conference, not for a therapeutic use. Listen to me. During those where color dopplers were not there. So I presented around 30 or 50 cases of the uh, intracavernous injection papaverin for the diagnostic purpose. And if person gets an erection, whether it is a psychogenic problem, vasculogenic or any other, gets a good erection, the diagnosis is in, in your head. Muse, which is, it's a pessary which can be introduced, you know, 250, 500, 750, 1000 microgram. What happened that it causes the infection, pain, and the erection is not that good. The other is a vacuum erectile device. I have not found it very useful because it does not fit. And nowadays, some electronical operators are there. I was told that they are much better. And internal penile pump prosthetics, which are being used. And let me share with you, Dr. Rupin Shah, who is one of the leading urologists and who is a BC Roy awardee, his penile processes are already completed 25 years. It's a very simple, easily available, very economical. And, you know, I think this is one of the, we are, we are proud that we have got some such people over here. The other thing which happened with the PDE5 inhibitor, I said the word sex was not used even between husband and wife. No word like oral sex, no word like orgasm. Female were there just to supply as a supply and demand, if he says that I want to have sex, he has never bothered whether she enjoyed or not. But today, Glossy Magazine, you take any, and you will find that there is at least one article on sexuality, female sexuality. And what has happened? My first 100 cases, when I saw that five women had accompanied the male, not that they came with their problem, and three of them, I found that they had a vaginismus and two had some hysperionia. Today, the women in the afternoon, they find it out my number, call me, and then they come over here, bring their husband, bring them in my clinic that, you know, I'm not reaching an orgasm. More than 10 years back, there was a girl who came from Lucknow, a very conservative society, and she wanted to find out where is her G-spot. 
so it has made this subject very open and respectable today in the parties and private parties we can say the jokes about viagra and people laugh at you otherwise in olden days they say are you a mad person how can you talk about sex so these are the things which has happened with the viagra that we have realized as per the sexual and reproductive health and your relation is concerned very much lifestyle changes everybody says no alcohol smoking control obesity and control stress and how to do it we tell every other patient balanced diet sleep exercise and yoga whatever pd if i you, you use it but tell this and let me tell you if ajay does a survey 90% of our doctors our own we do not you know follow any one of them and i am also one of them my name will come the first in the list now diabetic mellitus i remember one of my patient he was a severely diabetic he had an erectile dysfunction and he was not and during those days very few diabetic drugs you know were concerned and he was not on insulin even well uncontrolled so his wife she got frustrated got into extra marital relation with the next door neighbor and when she was caught she tried to commit suicide now fortunately in a diabetic mellitus with the oral sildenafil citrate and other drugs and even injectables and even the implant we can give a different life let me tell you implant and injectable came much before the sildenafil citrate so this is what the diabetic mellitus is there depression whether the depression primary is due to sexual problem or sexual problem has occurred because of the drugs and the depression in all those cases the sildenafil vardenafil this is improve the depression and along with that i said there are so many antidepressants which are you know erectile friendly they can be used in this and the most important is the cardiac comorbidities i had a very interesting case he had gone to houston he was rather first when i was doing a family practice to go to dr mathur collected some of money and went for an operation afterward 3 years he was moving around and in his banyan you know that that is to wear a rudrax and continuously touch and when i saw him and i said what is this he said doctor i feel like having sex but my wife is saying no when i asked his wife he said i don't want him to get an another heart attack such a big manual everything was told what to do but nobody talked about sex today after the bypass surgery or with the cardiac problem myocardial infarction if the resting ecg has come normal if their drugs does not contain any nitrates either organic or any other form of nitrate if the person is able to walk for 1 mile in a, on a plain ground for 20 minutes he can cover that or he can climb the two staircase flight of staircase within 10 to 15 second or on a stress stress bruce you know protocol if he can do for 4 minutes i think that is more than enough you can say you can have sex with a light medication and other things a uh, light food and have sex and you can give them if there are no nitrates safely and when you give a short acting i would prefer that sildenafil citrate that if at all they get uneasiness perspiration chest pain they should stop it they should tell the doctor what is happening and then they could be put on a supportive things and after if it is a sildenafil after 24 hours they can give other drugs or in case of tadalafil it can take a 48 hours today lot of things have come out gene therapy vasoactive intestinal polypeptide stem cell platelet rich plasma low intensity pulse uh, ultrasound low intensity shock wave therapy and many more to come it's very welcome whatever new things are come it is good to be in our armamentarium studies are going on sometimes the controversies are some are in favor some are in against but the time will tell us but this all requires a lot of setup machines in your place while in once you are doing in any corner of india with sildenafil citrates that is pd5 in inhibitors you can do a very good practice and help it now i was thinking that how did i also manage my sexual problem just before the sildenafil period it was a big question and let me share with you i was lucky to attend the workshop by masters and johnson and what i did what masters and johnson came out they came out with the sensate focus you can see the word itself is a crude there is no word sex i have converted into sex exercise as far as the masters and johnson was concerned they were in the indian university in their campus they will ask the couple to come there and be there for 15 days first their master will talk to the male 
the johnson will talk to female then second day they switch over johnson will talk to the male and master will talk to the female patient and the third day they have a round table conference where all of them will discuss and they know that somebody is there to defend them of the same sex and by that time all investigations were done what i have found i have converted that module into indian they were co therapists i am a solo therapist if i require sometimes examination has to be done of a female patient i ask my wife she is a family physician she does it couples were required in our country it's not necessary that couple will come so many communities they don't allow the wife to know they don't want to tell the wife they have some extra marital relationship outside they are unmarried not getting married they are divorced they are separated or they are widowed so i can take a couple or a single masters and johnson mostly they were institution only they used to say that you come and stay in our campus no office no home now that may not be possible in india so what i say home or a hotel now hotel only couple of cases i can count you know those who came from either dubai or usa for a short period and suddenly they realize in the last week that we have to go for this so nearby you know hotels i had kept them and tried to call them twice or thrice a day and once that is done online i have been doing it break through the routine so you have to go in that center while here your routine continues your office continues everything here there was a very interesting thing happened that there was one couple who is from a distant suburb and i used to ask them and they so get every time on tuesday a particular day on you know they said we would like to have a your appointment once i was busy so i said i can be wednesday friday or anything they were very much sorry they said no sir give us tuesday only i said what is the reason in bombay every city has got a good temple where people go siddhi vinayak right from amitabh bachchan to uddhav thakre everybody goes there and they say whatever your dreams are there it will come true so after third year of marriage they were not having you know sex so they came to me but at home they used to say that we are not going to a sex over this we are going to siddhi vinayak temple and the blessings will come and will so the routine will continue the referral not possible today i can refer to a psychiatrist cardiologist diabetologist endocrinologist two weeks while here there is no two weeks it is ongoing 10 to 15 session depends upon ordinary myths are there or is there is erectile dysfunction or premature ejaculation or there is a marital disharmony or there is a family dynamics which are playing it's a time bound in my case it's a flexible i say 30 to 45 minutes and initially it takes a little more time but once they come whether they have done the my homework or not if done correctly then success will then go to another level or if they have not done it i say you will have to go back to again that and do that homework and come to me and if not done why not done those road blocks has to be fine family not involved aaj itne saalon ke baad bhi saas bhi kabhi bahu hoti hai aur wo chalta hi rehta hai so our country the family joint family mother in law sister in law the other elder daughter in law all of them there are nijat and they create lot of problem so sometimes you need to have a fam- family to be involved no pharmacotherapy today i am lucky that in my armamentarium every year something new is coming up so i am much better much stronger much experienced much knowledgeable today surrogate partner master said johnson had used about 120 150 you know surrogate partner means they will come like a professional person help them out get a person but you are getting all right with that person not with your partner i would say surrogate partner i would never use it it is ethically medically and legally wrong these are my own views you know and people have ideas they can use it marital guidance is not given the most important marital guidance counseling and other things can be done in the clinic vacation is lost 15 days you have gone to masters and johnson therapy come back and vacation is lost while well, here the second honeymoon starts once your treatment is over you can really go wherever you want mathura and mahabaleshwar or shrinagar or you can go to switzerland and the last but not least secret i am telling you i teach them a relaxation technique because why this is happening apart from that there is a lot of you know performance anxiety fear of failure and spectator in role and let me tell you sex not for the reproduction not for the recreation but it is for the relationship so with the all sildenafil citrate injectables and other things you know even implant 
we are giving a person power to get an erection, but we are not solving. So there is no holistic approach. It is, I use the model of psycho, bio, and social. What I use the model is a holistic model where mind, body, and soul, all of them are involved. And once you do, then and the life will flower. Friends, I conduct a lot of workshops because to do a sex therapy, I'm telling you, it is you, you what do you need? Nothing. You don't need a gazettes and instruments and other thing. And I have been practicing. And sometimes I do feel jokingly I say, I can put a board outside my clinic. I only treat Viagra failed cases. But that does not put the Viagra down. Viagra is a drug of choice. It has made millions of people all around the world their life beautiful. Once again, let me thank Dr. Ajayan and his team for asking me to share my thoughts on pre and post Viagra. At some places, I might have told my stories about the theories you can read anywhere. All of you are knowledgeable, all of you have been practicing, but this will remain in your mind and even one or two points you carry, I'm sure will be very, very happy. Thank you very much.